So the water softener is uh, taking permanent hardness out of our water before we put it into our uh, hot well tank and then obviously into the boiler. We don't want any of that permanent hardness in the boiler because it's going to lay out a scale. So this is a fairly important piece of your boiler house and it needs to be checked regularly. The units themselves are quite a cheap mechanism. They've got gears and uh, little uh, moving parts inside them. So they can go wrong. So they need checking regularly. The first thing we're going to do when we come to the water softener is check and make sure that we've got adequate amount of salt. As you can see from our salt bin, we don't currently have enough salt in there and that needs topping up. It should be about uh, half full and the water level should be just above or just below the level of the salt. The next thing we're going to do, we'll actually look at the uh, controller and we'll see what the current position is in terms of operation. From this we can see the current time of day, we can see the number of cubic metres of water left to run on the current uh, resin bed and we can see which resin bed is in operation. So currently we've got 42 metres to run and it's running on U1. Okay. When we're doing these checks, what we're looking for each day is to make sure that things are changing and that everything is actually uh, working and the, the numbers are making sense. If something's not right, it needs investigating. If we're going to investigate it, the next step would be to take a sample out of the softener and make sure it is actually producing soft water. The best time to do that, the most likely time when you're going to have hard water, is at the back end of the cycle on a particular resin bed. When you're doing these checks, you need to make sure, obviously, that you're alternating between U1 and U2, so that you get a, a good uh, idea that both resin beds are actually working equally. So the next thing we're going to do is we'll move on to uh, taking a sample and actually having a look at the hardness of the water.